Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Melissa. Today's look is actually a look I wore in my husband tag Christmas edition. If you haven't seen that yet, I'll leave the link down below. But in that video, I was wearing a nude lip and today I made it more festive with the red lip. I know everybody loves to wear a red lip during the Christmas time. If you aren't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel so you know whenever I post a new one. If you guys wanna see this look, just keep watching. Okay guys, so we're starting with the eyebrows done. I already have a video on my channel, so I'll leave the link down below. So we're gonna start off with the eyes first because it's gonna get a little crazy, a little dirty. So I'm starting off with the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. For today's look, we'll just be using the Morphe 350 palette. To set our primer, I'm gonna take this shade here. This will just ensure all the other shadows we'll be applying to blend easily over. For our transition shade, I'm going to be taking this one here. We'll be doing a cut crease look today. So basically what we're going to do with this shadow is place it on top of our crease. And as always, I'm going to flick it out towards my eyebrow. Because that's just the look I like for my eye shape. Now taking a more redder brown, this one here. We'll also be placing that in the crease. Or above our crease, I should say. And then go back and blend. Now I'm gonna add a touch more red. Also placing that above the crease. Blending is key. Now to clean up our lid, we're going to take some e.l.f. concealer. This is the e.l.f. under eye concealer and highlighter duo. I'm going to take the concealer side and just cut that crease. with that cream shade that we did all over our lid. And that's actually not gonna be our lid shade. I'm actually gonna wet my brush with my NYX Dewy Spray. And I'm gonna take this shimmery pink shade here. Don't worry about the edges because that's why we did our eyes first because I knew it was going to get messy. We're going to clean that up with foundation and concealer. Got some fallout. I'm also going to highlight that brow bone with the same bone shade that we set our eyes with. Now to make this look a lot more glam, I'm going to take this white liquid pen from Rimmel and outline the crease that we made. And I'm gonna do this eye and then we'll do a second coat so the white stands out a lot more. We're gonna move on to the NYX Liquid Crystal Liner. I'm gonna place that right over top of that white so it's more festive and in your face. Moving on, I'm going to put my Too Faced mascara on as well as the G Baby lashes. Lashes are on, now I'm going to hide my lash band with some eyeliner. I'm quickly going to add a little wing because I think that will look better. Finally moving on to the face, I'm going to take my Rimmel Fix and Perfect Primer. For foundation, I'm going to put the Dream Velvet Foundation and 75 Natural Beige. And I'll be blending that in with my Morphe MB39 brush. I'm actually going to speed through my foundation and concealer since I have previous videos of me putting it on. Thank you. 
I'll be bronzing with the Revlon Color Stay Powder in medium deep. For blush today, I'm going to take my ColourPop Prenup blush. And I'm actually not going to contour today. I'm just going to take that Cameo powder again and place that under our blush and bronzer to really sharpen up that line without actually contouring. Then I'm going to highlight with my Wild and Radiant palette from BH Cosmetics, my favorite. I'm going to take this pinky champagne one right here and highlight the tops of our cheekbones. Then I'm going to take my big fluffy brush from Real Techniques and just blend all that together. To finish off the eyes, I'm going to take that first transition shade and place that on our lower lash line. Now I'm going to add just a touch of that red, but more towards the outer half. To finish off the eyes, I'm going to tight line with my NYX gel pencil and add some mascara. To finish off this look, we're going to move on to the lips. Actually, in the husband tag, I was wearing a nude lip, but today, since I'm feeling a little festive and this is for a holiday glam look, I'm going to use a red lip. I'm going to use the Ofra Liquid Lipstick in Ultimate Red. And that actually completes this holiday glam look, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.